Okay, so customizing your charts. You probably have a color scheme in mind and it may not be blue and red. So let's talk about customizing charts. So maybe we want to compare, we want to see how many cherry tomatoes Isis eats depending on the day of the week. Um, well, looks like Tuesdays and Wednesdays she eats many more cherry tomatoes than any other day of the week. Um, so, let's say we go over to customization. We can change the title of the chart, something like cherry tomatoes every, every day. And we can maybe get rid of the legend because it's very clear here. And maybe we don't like this font. Maybe we want it to be in Verdana because that's a better font just all around. And maybe we want this title down here to say number of cherry tomatoes. And we don't want it to be italicized. And maybe we're doing it in some color that is this. And maybe our axis labels are also in that color. And um, grid lines. Hmm, that's ugly. Let's do two. Mm, three? Four. Yeah, four looks good. There we go. We see that there were either four or five. And maybe throw some minor grid lines in there. Ooh, yeah, that looks nice. Um, and now we want these bars to also be that color, maybe lighter. Yeah. Um, and ah, we're adding them up. We should average them. That makes no difference. Okay, interesting. And yeah, maybe this title to complementary color, maybe what looks good with that? Right? No. Ooh, Sam has no taste. Uh, um, okay. Uh, hopefully, you get the idea. Oh, if you have different, maybe this is a chart with uh, multiple things on it, bars and lines, you would change the other bits here. So that's how you would customize a chart. Um, let's hit cancel. While I'm looking at this, though, I want to point out that it's pretty cool you can do that with day of the week. Um, but maybe you want a more straightforward chart. Just throw it all on there. Ta-da. You just put everything in one. Um, I don't recommend doing this too much because it's overwhelming, hard to color right, and I really don't see how it tells you anything. Yeah, so I don't recommend doing everything all in one. But maybe for your grand finale, like the end of the fireworks show, 